Matthias Martins is a football player and also a football coach from the distant football kingdom of Brazil. After being involved in the sport for over 30 years, the 36-year-old has continued to chase his football dream in China since moving there in 2007. As head coach at the Soccer World Training Center in the city of Dongguan in South China's Guangdong Province, Martins has been training children ranging in age from 3 to 16 years old. The center was established by the Soccer World International Group, a British group founded in 1998. Hello. You are the first time to come. You call what name? Zhu Jingyang. Zhu Jingyang. I call Martins. Okay, we are the first one to come. 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 Oh, very good. Since I start to teach kids and have the the attention of the Chinese kids, and they love uh, to learn and they have this this passion and they give me a lot of love. Martin started playing football at the age of five. He's played in numerous clubs in South America, largely second or third division clubs. My old brother lives in Dongguan, so he invited me to come to visit Dongguan. And when I come here the first time, I like so much China, and uh, I saw some good uh, possibilities to my job here. Martin's first trip to Dongguan made enough of an impression on him to make him want to stay there. He gave himself two years to learn Chinese, get to know more local people, and figure out how to get into football in China. The football is is very good、uh, to open doors. Yeah,、uh, when I came to Dongguan, when I saw、uh, some Chinese playing football, I came and、uh, they let me play, and they they see I play very good, and then start to make friends, start to talk, but I cannot understand.、It、was very funny. Martin's football skills have brought him great opportunities in Dongguan. In 2009, he was invited by the city to join a professional club called Songshan Lake and played in the first Guangdong Provincial Football Tournament. That was 2009, and、uh, Dongguan team, Songshan Lake team, was the champion, and I was the best player and the top scorer. So that was my open the doors to me to to be here working full time with with football. Martins was long eager to become a professional coach. As he acquired a Brazilian coaching license before leaving the country, he was lucky enough to get a chance to play a football match with Soccer World ambassador and famed footballer Michael Owen. Owen's presence was part of the company's efforts to expand its football centers in China. Martin's performance in the match was highly praised. It was a mix. I was doing football player and coach. So that time, my dream, my goals to come to China start to to be real. Martin said Chinese kids are generally introduced to football too late to have much chance of high-level success. Here in China,、uh, the the football is different. We are not teaching these kids how to play very good, how to score many goals. We are in the basement. We are trying to make they love football. This is the first goal we need to make, and then if they like football, they want to come. We after we start to teach them a little more high level. When we have one more kid join us, is one more big、uh, big dream is happen. This year, 150 children are learning about football at Martin Center. Sometimes I feel a little tired, but when I came in the morning, very early, sometimes cold, and I see the kids coming to play football, this renew my energy. And make me start everything again. Understand? Friend of the kids, he have. I really enjoy. Yes.、Yeah. I enjoy more than the kids. <laughs> and one more kid in the in the field is me. Martins was also pleased to hear about reforms that were recently announced by the government that are expected to give the country's football performance a shot in the arm, as the performance of some of its national teams has been less than satisfactory. The reforms will also call for nurturing more young football talent. Yeah, it's it's a good beginning. It's a and also it's a good opportunity to to soccer coaches 
in a lot a lot jobs we will we'll have a lot of people can can also start to teach in football because now everybody's looking for football Martins has also been cultivating a life outside of football in Dongguan his wife works in the city as a dance instructor and their child was born there my wife is from Mexico so it's a mix and my baby was born here in Dongguan my baby is local but the father and the mother-in-law Martin said football has helped him adapt to China, adding that the country has also helped him realize his dream of coaching. He said he sees a promising future for Chinese football. My big goal is be a coach in a professional club to to professional teams. But uh, I think I'm not ready yet. I need more time. I need to learn more Chinese. I need to be prepared. I need to learn more about football because never enough. My idea here is stay longer, be part of the, of China. Now my feeling Dongguan is my home.